My name is Sonia Andujar, and uh, I am the organizer for the Love of Art exhibition that is coming up in September 19th at the Stevens Gallery, Harvard Square. And the idea uh, of this exhibition came about uh, when I attended a conference by the Cambridge Peace Commission about race and class. Uh, Reverend Fred Small from the First Parish Church was there, and he said that the, the Stevens Gallery was a community um, place uh, accessible to community groups such as myself. Before that, I attend housing meetings, which are very long. Many of us doodle while the meetings is going on. And after the meeting, we start saying, oh my, you know, so you draw, you like this? And we got into the art conversation. And the idea came up, why don't we do an art exhibition? So uh, those two things came about, and this is the dream uh, about For the Love of Art, because really all of us who are in there are tenants who live on subsidized housing, either public or voucher. We all have a lease with the Cambridge Housing Authority. So we don't have an opportunity too often to kind of exhibit our art. And that's how the For the Love of Art came about. It's my artwork, I love uh, painting faces, especially eyes, uh, you know, to see through the through people's eyes, you can see their state of mind and so on. And this is, uh, could be any tenant, you know, attending a housing meeting, worried by rent increases, possible evictions, things like that. Now, I have not taken art lessons per se. I've taken a few lessons here and there. And when I retired, I got introduced into watercolor. And um, I was and continue to be ecstatic over, over this medium, which I'm trying to, to, to conquer. So I go to the library, uh, public library, get books on watercolor and uh, teaching myself. So, because I like faces, I like different faces. When I look at, at, at people, magazines, and so on, there's a face or a pose or, or eyes that strike me. And um, this is how I came about to, in, in painting mm -hmm. uh, this guy here. Uh, the eyes are, you know, uh, awesome. And um, he seems to be smiling. He could be any place in a bar having a cigar and just listening to some boring conversation and he's smiling, just saying, well, I need to put up with this or whatever.